This 438 Monster Energy Skater is powered by Mercury Racing 1100 comp engines, which is uh, the class spec. Jeff Perlman, I'm with Mercury Racing. I'm the Director of Engineering, and uh, we're down here for race support, for primarily for Class 1, but also for the other classes running our products. So all of the Class 1 boats are powered by the Mercury Racing 1100 competition engine. It's a 9-liter twin-turbocharged uh, dual overhead cam V8. It's specifically designed and constructed by Mercury Marine. Uh, there's no GM parts in it or anything like that. It's all our own design. It's all Mercury Racing. And uh, every one of these boats runs the same engine. So they're all very equal performance. So we come in around the same time that the boats come in. Uh, for the class one boats, we install a data logger, we install special control DCUs, and uh, then when the boats go out and test, they come back, we can help them look at their data, see if there's any flags there for things that they maybe want to change in their setup. And then on Sunday after the race, we pull all the data off the data loggers, we go through it, we make sure that everything meets the requirements, and then we work with the uh, class one uh, organizers, with RWO, with P1, and make sure everybody understands you know, that everything passed and everything meets the rules. And uh, then we pull all of our, our special equipment back off the boats and put their stock ECUs back on there so they can go and test between races. And then next race, we just repeat it all again. Yeah, definitely some stuff that we wanna help the teams work through. So we'll take any of those issues back with us to the factory. We'll look at it and uh, you know, before Sarasota, we'll recommend some fixes, some changes and uh, hopefully you know, each race is better than the next, that's our goal. So DF Young you know, was an existing boat that had different power in it, they switched to QC4s. Um, so we invited them to come and test with us at Lake X, they were there just this week, helping them get things sorted out, they're on the phone with our guys, you know, so making sure that they understood all the rigging and everything was set up the way it needed to be. MCON, brand new boat, uh, the good thing with MCON is they rigged that at Performance Boat Center. Performance Boat Center does a ton of other QC4 work, so those guys are pretty familiar with the engine package. So it is actually pretty easy for them. But yeah, first time on the water, you're always finding new things. You're, it's always going to be some gremlins in there, some setup issues. Uh, but they're off to a great start, both teams. Uh, so they're just, you know, they're only going to go up from here. You know what, if we're going to come down and support a class, it's it's kind of the same thing so if we have you know we started out we had three boats and then four boats six boats today we'll still probably have about the same size crew we're getting to be pretty good at this and we can work with the teams too they know what to do when the mercury racing team walks up to them they know the drill they can get in there they can help us swap ecus get the data loggers in and out it's pretty smooth now we've been doing this now for i think three years and uh, yeah everybody kind of knows the drill it works really well <laughs>